I started with the Referendum Commission and they sent me out a statement and they said that the role of the Referendum Commission is to explain a referendum proposal, to promote public awareness of a referendum and to encourage people to vote. They also said that the law gives it no role in the regulation or overseeing of campaign funding, spending or advertising. So needless to say, they're not responsible for what actually gets advertised on posters. They also have guidelines on the rules of postering available on their website. However, this relates more to the issues surrounding littering law and the physical placement of posters, which is handled by the local authorities. So I got in touch with our local authorities here, which is obviously Dublin City Council, and they sent me a statement then late last night. So they said that Dublin City Council cannot regulate the content of referendum posters. We do not consider that it is within the scope of our statutory powers under the relevant legislation to remove posters based on perceived offensive content. I then got in touch with the ASAI, which is the Advertising Standards Association of Ireland, and they say they only deal with commercial advertising regulation, nothing political. I finally inquired with the press ombudsman who confirmed that they have no regulation over the posters and neither does the ASAI. So all in all, it seems to be an extremely grey area and no one particular body seems to regulate the actual content of the referendum posters and advertising.